afternoon. First up, we've got Monsieur. My French is not very good. Uh, presenting is Barry, Gi or Barry Givens, uh, Eric Williams, and Mario Taylor. Good afternoon, TechCrunch. I'm here today to talk to you about cocktails. Yes, cocktails. Don't you love them? 66% of Americans enjoy social drinking, but the experience could be a little better. For instance, does this scene look familiar to anyone? Waiting 10 minutes to get a drink, wasting a quarter of your social time in line at the bar. And when you get to the bar, you get an inconsistent drink because there's no national testing or certification to become a bartender. Now you could get bottle service, but then you're stuck all night pouring the same horrible drinks because the average person can only make a few. The problem is that bartending and social drinking have not been innovated in centuries. So we're here to disrupt the cocktail service industry and upgrade your social drinking experience. We invented and introduced to you today, Masseur, the artificially intelligent robotic bartender. My name is Barry, this is Eric, and we're the co-founders of Masseur. We met while studying mechanical and electrical engineering at Georgia Tech. Uh, please go to Masseur. Masseur is an artificially intelligent robotic bartender that can expertly craft your cocktails at the touch of a button. You can browse gorgeous pictures on the screen of the cocktail list and also see interesting tidbits of information with our high-resolution touchscreen interface. It has awesome algorithms that allow for features such as the strength slider. The strength slider allows you to take it easy and slide all the way down to lightweight, but if you want to have a big night, you can slide all the way up to a boss. Poor boss, Eric. You can transform your masseur into any bar in the world by choosing a theme package. A theme package includes a custom cocktail list and look and feel so that you can transform your night from a nightclub in San Francisco to a trendy bar in London or a tiki bar in Hawaii. Can we go to mobile? Masseur comes with a mobile app that allows you to order a drink from across the room. The mobile app also learns you and can even make recommendations. And if you're not sure what you want, you can go to Masseur and say, Masseur, make me something sweet. Masseur connects with other systems using Bluetooth and Wi-Fi that allows for some very interesting interactions. For instance, it can offer a celebratory drink when your favorite team wins a game, or if you're in the middle of a big presentation, you might need to calm your nerves. <laughs> That helps. <laughs> so we wouldn't make it this convenient without also being responsible. Masseur also comes with tracking your consumption, alert alerting you when your blood alcohol level is high, and it also helps you get a cab. Can we please go back to slides? The brains of Masseur is a microcontroller that orchestrates thermoelectric coolers, uh, pumps, as well as sensors and other mechanical components that allow for precision mixology. So now that we know the Masseur is cool and people love it, what do business owners think about it? We've deployed Masseur in nightclubs, arena suites, and outdoors at hotel cabanas. <laughs> One of the main features that business owners love about Masseur is the Masseur Central Management. Please switch to the web app. Here you can have a look at the Masseur Central Management. Now club owners have a robotic workforce that can monitor in real time the needs and usage of their customers, while also uncovering opportunities for additional revenue by anticipating when these customers would need refills or service. For example, you can see here that Table 11 is running low on whiskey and they'll need a bottle shortly. The business intelligence inside the central control system allows owners to have knowledge to say, hey, on Friday between 12 and 1, our tequila sales are down 50% um, during that time on Saturday. So now the owner has the knowledge to come back and run a promotion on Friday to increase his Friday tequila sales to that of Saturday. Masseur makes great tasting drinks that people love and businesses become profitable. Back to slides, please. So how do we make money? There are many verticals that can benefit from Masseur, including nightclubs, arena suites, hotels, restaurants, giving us a $2 billion target market. 
And we chose to initially focus on table service industries. And we're, we're coming to the table service industries with a very precise pricing option, a setup fee and a monthly subscription. So why table service, do you ask? 80% of nightclubs, 80% of revenue in nightclubs comes from table service. The top 1% makes $1 billion in revenue a year in table service. The average nightclub has 40 tables and can deploy Masur for just $12,000. This is less than 3% of their revenue um, on table service. And similarly with arena suites, that's another $90 million to go on top of the $150 million market opportunity with nightclubs. In general, the world is moving towards automation and robotics that make our lives better. And we're in line with companies such as Nest and iRobot to continue this growing trend. And we are proud to announce today that Masur is on our website for pre-order at masur.co. And we are Masur, the future of social drinking. All right. That was a, that was a great presentation. Judges, what do you guys think? Okay, um, well, I have, a, I have a couple questions. Okay. Uh, the question is, why, why now, right? Because this kind of robotic technology and microcontrollers were available before. Why is now the ideal time to capitalize this on this? And how do you make this defensible? So we have two patents, we have two patent pendings. And when you ask why now, it's a time where technology has come together, like you said, with the microcontrollers, um, the iOS, the Android, it is very easy and cheap. Um, we're using an Android tablet in here, and it's a time when tablets are at a cost where now, from a margin standpoint, it's beneficial to release products such as this and allow for the companies to make money as well as the business owners. Thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, I haven't done a lot of table service, but I imagine when people are ordering you know, $500 bottles of vodka, they're kind of over-ordering and not actually drinking a lot of it. Uh, how do you deal with that? Aren't these clubs going to miss out on that revenue? No, so what we've seen is that in, um, in our research is that when people order table service, they're normally with big crowds. So you know, you're, you're going to order table service with 10 or 11 people and you're paying $500 a bottle. And the issue there was that you're getting the worst drinks in the entire club. Someone's paying $10 and they're going to get a professionally made drink at the bar and you're paying $500 for a bottle and you're basically sitting there making the same horrible cranberry vodka the entire night. So now we're giving business owners an opportunity to increase and upgrade that environment for their most lucrative customers and put this in the nightclub table service as well as arena suites is the, the same scenario. These are their most lucrative customers and they're getting the worst service other than the plush couch that they get, the plush couch that they get in the section. <laughs> so we're allowing them to upgrade this and at a very, um, at a very um, attractive pricing model. So I have two questions, and the caveat is that it's been a long time since I've been at bars. All right, <laughs> out of all bars. Right. But first of all, did you solve? Is, did you build this to solve your own problem um, that you guys had that <laughs> frustration? And, and second, no, did you think, oh wow, we're so frustrated being here, we need something like this? And second, is it a problem that people are desperate to solve, like that they're so, going to use this? So to answer the first question. Yes, it is a problem that, that we've dealt with. Um, everything from um, uh, me and my fiance went out and had some drinks. Um, we had table service, and she's a doctor, and she's always seeing these little nuances. And she noticed that they put the, same, the, the bottle in the same ice that everybody puts in the cup. So you have this nasty bottle that's been touched by all the people that work in the club, the distributors, you know, coming off the trucks, and you yourself while you're drinking, you know. And then they sit it in this ice, and then you grab the ice and put it in your cup. And it's just all these little nuances that go with table service that we're able to solve with our machine. Okay, and, and people are really, like, desperate for Oh, Oh, yeah, definitely. So we've deployed, we've um, talked to nightclub owners, um, hotels and their suites, um, arena suites. And one of the big things on top of just upgrading the experience for their customers are control center. Being able to monitor every single of your most lucrative customers with an iPad app, right there, you're, I mean, you can have 70 tables, and now what happens is, if you go to, uh, to a club, there's a waitress that comes by like every 10 or 15 minutes, whether you need a drink or need service or not, and it's, kind of, it's very inefficient. Hmm. So now that club owner has the opportunity to say, hey, 
he said, um, Mario, table five, they're running low on two liquids. Why don't you go drop it off instead of sending Mario to 10 tables and figuring out what needs to be refilled and then coming to get the refills and coming back. So from a business perspective, it's very important to those um, club owners and those arena suite owners to upgrade the experience for their most lucrative customers. And from a customer standpoint, who wouldn't want to drink from a robotic bartender <laughs> when you go and pay $500 for a bottle? So, and, and to caveat, the, the consumers that we've demoed with and beta tested with, they have also loved the machine. And uh, we have so tons of video on consumers like, holy crap, this is just the best thing I've ever used. So it, it's definitely um, fixing a problem for those business owners. So can we try it? Can we see oh, it? Oh, yeah, definitely. We have glasses up here. We have, we have some ice. Fantastic. So no, you come and try it and use the machine. And we want you to get the whole experience. <laughs> um, I'll get it enough for we're done. Uh, for the <laughs> okay. really desperate consumers that uh, Jessica you know, mentioned, have you thought about actually selling it at home, like direct to consumer? Um, yeah, so we found that there are four different areas where, um, where the masseur fits, or four different use cases. We have the luxury suite version. Then there's also one behind the bar to actually help accommodate the bartenders during busy times. And then there's one in front of the bar, sort of a kiosk where you pay per drink as the actual customer. And then the final is putting it in your home. So those are all things that are on our roadmap, but we just chose to initially, so that we can have a focus and come to market strong, we chose to initially focus on the table service. Uh, how do you, you know, what's the gross margin of the product and, and how do you increase the gross margin as you increase the number of units that are sold? So right now, uh, we're getting them manufactured in China. We have our first production run in December and our COGS are $900. And with our revenue and with our pricing model, we're pretty much paying for the unit up front with the setup fee, with the 995 setup fee. We're paying for the cost of goods. And then we're, so the average nightclub is a $12,000 per month um, customer for Masur. All right, we're unfortunately out of time. Uh, that was Masur, that was great. I, uh, I'm excited about that one. Thank you. I would use it. Uh, would you drink? I have to try. You want to get a drink?